Hey there, YouTube. Do you know the feeling when you need something new, something fresh, new challenge? Well, I had that feeling last year, and it was that moment when I stopped playing Elite and started to focus on other games I had on my library for quite some time. I played some Need for Speed, a bit of PGA Tour, Spider-Man, GTA, Red Dead Redemption, Ghost Recon Breakpoint and many others. And after my absence I came back and I was kinda lost in my cockpit. It just didn't felt the way it felt before. Even the usual enjoyment of my opponent's shields dropping after shredding its power plant with the flechettes doesn't felt that good anymore. Besides, there are just two kind of enemies if you're using flechettes, those who are overpowered and those who are underpowered. And every now and then in between you're facing a real opponent, a real challenge. But I already fought them all. The big ships, the small ships, the meta ships, with shields, with too much shields or without shields. I fought the wing gankers, the cloggers, the loggers, the hackers. And there isn't hardly anything I haven't seen when it comes to PvP. I'm at a point where PvP just isn't interesting anymore. It just isn't what it once was anymore. So I set myself a new challenge, something completely different and new to me. And that was the moment when Project One Year was born. I want to go out and spend the whole year of 2023 just exploring the galaxy. And for all the explorers out there that may doesn't sound like a long time for you, but for me it is. I'm not the typical explorer. And every time I tried it, I self-destructed after some days just to be back in the action again. But I don't just go out without a plan. First I want to go to the south end of the galaxy, at least the furthest I can go, and when I reach that point I want to circle around the edge of the galaxy. To me, that's a big challenge, and I hope that I can make it through the year without going through the self-destruction highway back home. I'm already about 8k light years away from the bubble, and I still haven't reached the edge of the galaxy, but I already feel different, and I start to understand why some of you actually enjoy exploring because I start to enjoy it as well. And today I want to show you some scenes of my journey. I still have to learn how to use the free camera and record some space footage just as good as some of you out there, but I'm trying. So enjoy episode one of Project One Year.
Anyway, catch you later. Catch you later.